the world's core strengths? It's members, it's people, it's vision, it's beliefs, um, especially the kind of wealth of experience that it has from a, a, a number of cultures and traditions. Um, the, the Commonwealth understands um, how, the, how uh, the international community may be able to deal with a certain problem or, or, or an issue in, in, in the international arena more than any other institution. Now, um, I don't want to mention other institutions, uh, but some of the other institutions have done exactly very silly things in trying to settle issues and, and uh, uh, come up with solutions for problems. So, it's people. Okay. And what key issues do you think the Commonwealth should be focusing on? Um, well, democracy, still. Um, um, democracy and climate change. Now, I think both of these things are very related and linked. Democracy, human rights and climate change are, are all linked. Um, without good governance, we cannot have the kind of um, um, adaptation programs, neither can we have the kind of mitigation programs that we want. So it's very important to have a, a, a structure that delivers consultation. Uh, and and multi-party democracy seems to be the only thing around. And it works. Um, it is working in the Maldives. Um, so the Commonwealth should focus very much on proactively encouraging uh, democracy. Um, they could do more in that. And not just simply after a fall of a regime or, or when a regime is toppled that they should engage. But I, um, after having said this, um, um, I do understand uh, and I do realize how sophisticated the Commonwealth has been dealing with a number of issues, especially in the case of the Maldives. Mm -hmm. Their engagement was, um, at times when we were in the opposition, it was frustrating. Um, and at times we thought that they were not doing much. But I think uh, their methods of engagement um, have yielded good results. They should keep at it. Okay. And 2009 is the 60th anniversary year of the Commonwealth. How would you like to see the Commonwealth evolve in the coming years? Well, um, um, uh, uh, I think um, um, CMAG um, um, should become more of a body um, that encourages good governance. Uh, uh, and um, countries should be brought to CMAC if they don't behave well. Um, they should also encourage development of judiciary, uh, development of institutions uh, that would enhance democracy. Um, uh, in climate change, uh, I think uh, it would be good if Commonwealth would encourage um, more carbon neutral policies um, and, and encourage governments to become carbon neutral. So uh, this is, this is a, uh, we see um, uh, climate change as a security issue, as a human rights issue, as a justice issue, uh, more than an environment issue. Uh, so uh, you know we should really kind of redefine international relations, and I think the Commonwealth can play a, a, a forefront role in redefining international relations in respect to climate change.